Hi, I'm Brad Neenstead, Technology Product Specialist for Kinsey Manufacturing. Today we're going to talk about taking prescription files from desktop software, Ag Leader SMS, and moving it from there into the Blue Vantage display in the tractor cab. Let's get to it. We're here in our SMS desktop software. It's recommended you upgrade to version 19 so we have the ability to utilize the Kinsey Blue Vantage pre-setup and display setup built in to SMS. So we have a picture of the prescription map that we're going to use. So we go up into SMS in the upper left hand corner. We click on file and we choose export. And again with version 19 we have the ability to select export full device setup to a field display. So we can check that box up at the top click start and it brings us to our device setup utility. I've previously made a Blue Vantage device setup so I know that this one is for my Blue Vantage display. Over here on the right hand side is the edit column that allows you to select fields, prescriptions, and boundaries. Detailed information on how to do these steps can be found going to agleader.com or agleader's YouTube page for more information. Once you have this setup configuration complete, we can come down here to export to display. Again, in version 19, if we scroll down to Kinsey, we see that there is a Blue Vantage display option. This allows all of the setup and field configurations to be in the correct format to be directly dropped into the Blue Vantage display. We click on Blue Vantage, we then go export to selected display, we then choose where our USB stick is on our computer. So if you haven't plugged the USB stick into your computer yet, go ahead and plug that into the computer. Find where your drive is in this list. Mine is store and go right here. I click on that. That's where I want it to be. I click OK. It exports that to my USB and we're ready to go to the field and import our prescription and or boundary files. Now we're in the tractor cab. We've taken our files from SMS and we've put them on our USB. On the front of the Blue Vantage dock is a USB port for data file transfer. We're gonna take our USB with our prescription files and we're gonna place them into the Blue Vantage dock. Once you've placed it into the dock from the home page on the tablet, right now we just have the key on in the tractor. So we have our three first icons lit up, but we can do this in the office if we so choose. It doesn't have to be in the cab. There's a USB port on the right hand side of the tablet so you can do it in the office as well. Since we're in the tractor cab and we're on the planter dock, we have our USB stick in there. We press on the manage icon in the lower left hand corner. You can see we have previous tasks that we've already completed with this planter, but on the left hand side at the bottom you can see that we have prescription and boundary file option. We press on that selection and it comes to a manage screen and you can see that our import is highlighted from our USB. We're going to select import and it's going to show you all of the files that are on the USB. The nice part about as you look in here you can see that in this case our first file is a prescription. It says prescription right in the name. The next one right below it is a prescription as well so if we go to the top, we can either select all of our options or just select the prescriptions that we want. So we're going to select our prescription that is Neener Farms and the field is along Gremmel's, the field across the road from the house. We're going to select that one. We're going to hit our checkbox. And now you can see they have been imported into the display. Once you import those prescription files in, they're always in the display so you can remove the USB. We now can go to our home screen and now we can start the tractor and select our prescriptions. Now that we have the tractor running and our alternator is on, we're sitting in the field ready to plant. We go to our plant button at the top and of course we have previously planted tasks, but in this case we're gonna load one of those prescription files that we entered in. We're gonna add a new task. We're just gonna leave grower farm and field blank. It's not a requirement to start a prescription. In the lower left hand corner we're going to tap on our prescription box 
and it brings up the prescriptions that we imported earlier. So we're gonna select the prescription we want. So once you highlight it, it gives you a preview of what the prescription's gonna look like. We hit our checkbox to select it. We now see it in the prescription box down here. It tells you the name. It shows that now in our population box, we are using an RX as our RX, or as our planting population. We're now ready to go to the field to plant as long as our crop pressures are correct. We hit plant. We now go to our home screen and you can see in the upper right hand corner you have RX below our population. This will change depending on which commanded prescription is being used through the field. So now that we're done planting for the season or mid season we want to take files off. On the front of our dock is our USB port. We're going to take any USB, stick it into the USB port on the dock station. Once the USB is inserted, you can go to manage. And again, this is where we manage all of our file types. And the very first one that comes up is tasks. This refers to all of the previously planted tasks that you've already done. To export them, to take them to desktop software, we simply choose which one you want to export. Once you highlight it on the list, you see that export in the lower right hand corner is now active. Hit export. It says task export in progress, please wait. Once it's complete, hit okay, that task is done. Continue the same steps for the rest of the tasks that you want to export on the list. Once you're done with your tasks, you can remove your USB stick from the dock. Now we'll go back into the office, put it into SMS and see how to import those data files into SMS. Version 19, again, is required to have most of the functions that we're going to see today. First thing we're going to do is go to the Read Files selection box at the top, and we're going to click on that option, and we're going to select Read Files from a supported display or monitor, and click on Start Reading Files. We then need to go down to the Kinsey selection, and then select Kinsey Blue Vantage, and then we're going to want to select where those files are located. If you have not plugged in your USB stick into your computer, make sure and do that now. We then will select the drive and then select start processing files. Then brings up a window and shows you the files on there. In our case, we just have one field that we're going to import. If you have multiple fields, there'll be multiple lists. We can hit start processing files at the bottom. And again, the length of time depends on how many fields and the size of fields you have. Ours is just one, so it's pretty short. It'll process that information from the field. You can now see in the management tree in the upper left-hand corner, there's now a new grower up there called Kinsey. Our field name was 65, and then it tells you that we've planted corn, and here is our applied data in the lower left-hand corner in your preview window. So, all of your data is now imported in, and if this field had been planted before and you're adding data to it, that will of course just add a year to your management tree that you currently have existing. If you enjoyed this video, be sure and give it a thumbs up. If you have any questions or comments, please leave those below. If you'd like to see more videos by Kinsey, be sure and subscribe, select the alerts option, and you'd be the first to know when new videos are available. Thanks again for watching.